Hello everyone, welcome to another day in Shroud the Avatar. Today we find ourselves in game with Scarface. And I thought, seeing as I'm over on the Isle of Elysium, I thought I would have a look at Rumour Peaks. Well, Rumour Peaks is, as I said before, on the island of Elysium, which is the southern island. Just where this lovely little blue arrow is here, and it's just south of Artifus, and just on the left or east of Xenos. So it's a three-skull area. So let's go in and see what we find in there. Right, let's see what we find. Oh, keep an eye out, got some cages in here. And looks like some kobolds, kobold archers. Let's take a quick look at the map area. It's one of the ones with the cave thing that goes through the locked door there. So we'll do is we'll have a separated by two camps. Normally there's stayers up here. So let's go and see how we fare. First of all we'll have a look at the area over here. Shouldn't have too much of a problem here. actually got to do is in one of these tents is a key I believe we've got to obtain. So we'll just see if we can take these on. And we should be able to do with arrows. So it's certainly a level three skull which should be too much of a problem for this character. Try this tent first. Oh, there's a key there. Releasing cage key. Uh, yeah, we'll be okay. I'll take up this guy first. Take out the mage then. Yeah, come out combat so we can open up the chest. Wait for it to cycle round. And we should be able to open it now. After all that, nothing in it. Look. So is there anything in this one? Nope. That. Now there are, are pickaxes here, so if you don't have any uh, prosperity or unbreakable ones, they are worth picking up because you can use them in the mine. Right, so I think the key works on these cages, but I don't think. Oh, there we go. Loot the corpses, but I don't think you need to actually. I think you can loot them without actually opening the cage. I don't know what the cage key is for. So, there's this tent up here. Have a look in the chests. 
a similar thing to this in a group and we actually found things in the chest. Oh, there's some gloves. Right. Some big tents we're interested in, not the little tents. An old skirmisher, let's change to the sword. Trainer on the shield tactics. Behind us. Here's another one. This tent. Big chest here, we'll have to come out of combat so we can open it. Wood scrap. And cut the boxes over here. Book gets worth 25, so normally they're not worth anything. And I think in that one. I think you know, we can open sacks as well. Cloth helm. Can we open that sack? Yep. A little bit of loot off them. Throw the candle out. Let's have this tent over here. Nothing much in these tents. We have not been in here before. Leveling up on our shield abilities. Probably have been on that as cart there. Right. Now we open up that gate camp there. Let's change to an archer. Oh, just as somebody comes over. Oh, we're going to get a bit swamped here. So let's pull back. Just so we can get this archers over here. I don't want to take this guy down first. And what I'd like to do is take this guy down. And change into the swords and take down the rest. See what we find in the caves. Big stag on the way in. Archer, oh, so just change to the boat. Check the area for mining nodes as well. Not see many yet. Another archer. Cut coming in here. I'll put the change to the iron sword up. Go in that time it did. Change back to the bow. And he's down. Let's get our loot. To the main cavern. 
it's not anything. It's not anything at the moment. Not much ore in this cavern. Just bring up the map. It doesn't show any nodes on here, so some of some of these mines actually do have mining options in them. seen any at all in this one. Mine is empty. Skirmisher. Nice load of noise glitches. There's a bit of copper over here as well. over there. Which course oh got one over here. Got what looks like oh looks like a node and it's not. Looks exactly like a node. Let's take the granite. To. Right, let's carry on through the caves. Cabold skirmisher. Finish them off with the arrows. that box is it's telling me. So obviously there must be a key on somebody. Oh, some copper node up here. No granite node over there. Times three, times four on the matriculation. Nice four bits of copper and of one node. Oh, oh, that's not the way. I'm certainly going the right way. No, I want to go this way. And carry on through the mine. No, we don't. We're going to we've been in this large area. No, we haven't. We made it over here, didn't we? Yep, we made it in the bottom. Yeah, we'll carry on. Oh, another one. goes down. We should get a bit of gold off them. And our next target. Some copper node there. 
two pickaxes. The reason why I'm not picking up pickaxes is because I've got a prosperity pickaxe, which means it doesn't break. So and they're not worth anything in regards to money and you can't scrap them so but if you don't have a prosperity axe of course they are free axes in the game not no pickaxes quite a few of them in here as well This area. I love this particular mine to so make it sound like there's a lot going on. Let's have a quick look. No, it's not leading anywhere. There's some nodes down the bottom there by the looks of it, so I'm not going to bother with those. There's two, two people fighting here. Who's fighting here? I've got some bandits and some kobolds. One wants to attack me. It's a grand melee fight, but once they've finished attacking their targets, once they'll be attacking you. Like come from. Suddenly, a load of light come from somewhere. Don't know where the extra lights come from. Now, there's two, two parts to the tunnel here. That's not the one. This is the one on the way out. Which obviously we've got humanoids on this side of the tunnel. Some bandits. There's a little bit of copper in the mine. Or pass. Should be coming to the other end by now. We'll see what they're like out here. Some bears there. Just leveled up in another one of my passive thingies, the draw strength. Attacking, oh the Lord, not attacking me, are they? Put flame on and let's just somebody else attacking me? Nope. Let's hold them down.
Oh, there is somebody up there. I wonder if I can get him. Nope. Uh, now what we're looking for, let's see if we can get up there. There should be a bit of rope or something. There it is. Don't click on that. It puts us up on the ramp. And the bear's up here as well. I didn't want to get pushed off the bridge. Let's give this bear. Strange for bears to be up on a walkway. I can't see anything in there. Some wolves and deer in here. And some stair down here. So the stair camp down here. See him there. stay up first because he's a little bit stronger than the wolf. I'm skinning the wolf. Now with stairs you've got to be rather cautious because they can have fawns with them. If there's a fawn around he'll cast confusion on you. Even though if you kill the stayers, the forms generally don't attack you. Let's go another level. Just give us some damage resistance. Down here you should see there's another area with some form forms and stayers in them. Group here. I'm very cautious of what we're doing here. Let's take the arch out next. How are we doing? Too bad. A bit closer, we can get a bit more damage on him. Mage wants to move around. That's good on me. Let's come back there. 
takes it to another area, and the area just leads round to the attack that stack. Don't worry. Form which has stunned me. Quite a long stun on that one, I think I have to jump out of it. Forms don't normally attack, they're on their own. This is where I will in this video. So I hope you've enjoyed Rumour Peaks and if you are new to my channel if you click on the subscribe button you'll get to know when more of my content comes out. Please feel free to leave any comments in the comments section and thank you for watching.